We all take friction for granted, but used in the right way, it can be a really powerful force. To prove it, I bet these two really strong blokes yes. that I can stick these two books together using friction All right. and you won't be able to pull them apart. Is it? Let's try that. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, okay, you take that. Hold there. You take that bit. Right, go. Wait a minute. That's not a problem. Are you sure you can do it? Come on. You're <laughs> <laughs> coming off it. There's something wrong with this box, isn't it? It really is just friction holding them together. Honest. OK, so if I have two pieces of paper and I try to pull one over the other, then obviously it's really easy. But there is a tiny bit of friction there. What's happening is that the molecules in one sheet of paper are being attracted ever so slightly to the molecules in another, so it takes a little bit of effort to pull one over the other. Now, that's only a very small force, but if you know what you're doing, a lot of very small forces can add up to something really strong. If I push down a bit on the top sheet of paper, then I'm squeezing the two sheets together, so more of the two surfaces are touching each other. That means there's a bit more friction and it's harder to pull them apart. So if I take a whole lot of pages and interleave them together like this, then, well, go on, have a go. <laughs> oh, getting there, maybe. <laughs> I see your muscles going for it though. <laughs> <laughs> So the binding is pushing the pages together, just like when I was pushing down on the two sheets of paper. <laughs> the harder you pull, yeah, the more the pages are pushed together. Right. <laughs> I believe There's them. no cheating here. I believe them. I would have thought I could have done it. Yeah, I thought that would have been easy. Yeah. That's mad. I'm tired. Yeah. Unbelievable, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Unbelievable, that is. Unbelievable, that is. Unbelievable, that is. Unbelievable, that is.